Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to update the photo gallery in our website. So now this is the regional office Delhi website. Here you can see the photo gallery of the regional office. Now by default, all the photographs will be arranged in the tile format. But if you click on list by albums, if I click on this checkbox, it will display all the photographs in the form of folders. Now these folders are called as the albums. So we have total number of albums as 6 as you can see and in each album you have the multiple photographs. The number of photographs in each album are reflected at the bottom of each album. If I click on any of the albums, Suppose I click on art and culture craft, it will display all the photographs which are included in this album. Just like this, you have to create the album for your website. So let's go to our website, go to the dashboard and in the dashboard you can see this option image gallery. So click on add new. Here you will create the new album. Suppose the name of my album is Sample Album. Now here you have to write down the title of the album that you want to create. I am just writing it for explaining you all. Then you can see here the option Add Media. Click here add media and here you will find again the option create gallery. Click on create gallery. Now what we have to do is we have to select multiple photographs for our album. Means already we have created the folder and inside that folder we need different different photographs. So all these photographs will be selected from this media library and all these photographs will be created as a gallery under the album. So select the photographs that you want to add inside that gallery. So I have selected three photographs. Here tick marked means all these are selected. Now they will be grouped together under this album. Click on select gallery. Now see this gallery is created. Now I have added three photographs, click on insert gallery. Now some code will be added here, you don't have to worry about this code. You have added three photographs inside this sample album. After that just scroll downwards and you will find here on the right hand side the option set featured image. It means that when you will open your album, the cover page of your album will be shown by this photograph. So if I click here and if I select any of the image, suppose I select this scout and guides image. Now one, one thing you have to remember that the size of all these photographs must be same. I have set here the size as 1000 into 700 pixels. So all the photographs which will be included inside this album will be having the same size. So click on set featured image and click on publish. Now let's see whether it is visible or not. Go to the photo gallery. Now you can see sample album. It is visible and the cover page of this album is the scouts and guide photograph that I have set it by using the option set featured image. Also you can see that there are three photographs in this album which is visible from the bottom corner. So you can view the photographs, click on the view and all these photographs will be visible. So in this way you can add the different photographs in the albums. In your school you have different activities and for all the different activities you can create the albums and you can store the different images into the specific albums. Thank you.